my channel my name is Eagle Perez and today we are playing King of Fighters 15. It's been a while since I played this game so I am a little bit rusty but that can be fixed with a little bit of training. The roster has gotten a lot bigger since the last time I played but I am going to be sticking with my main girl King. I have a lot of respect for SNK especially since in King of Fighters they pay tribute to its competitive scene specifically its competitive region well one of the most competitive regions of KOF which is Mexico! This means a lot for me personally because, well, I'm Mexican. To see a company recognize and pay tribute to the regions that, well, has kept its competitive scene alive throughout its entirety, that is absolutely amazing. I wish more companies could do this. So right now, I'm just gonna spend a little bit of time inside of the training room, just going over my basic uh, king bread and butter combos. And then after that, we're just gonna play a few games and see how I do. Round one, ready, go! memed that Mexican moms who send their kids to go get some tortillas usually never get their change back. The reason for that is because literally every little bit of change that is ended up returned is always going to be spent on an SNK King of Fighters machine. It's funny because it's mostly true 
a lot of people do do that. And even I have to admit, I've done that once myself. Okay, that's a lie. I've done that multiple times. So growing up, I lived right near walking distance to a supermarket where they sold tortillas. And right next to it was a little flea market that had a lot of arcade machines. I remember specifically seeing the Neo Geo and every single time I went over, I ended up getting two things with the extra change. Either one was a soda or two was a few rounds of King of Fighters. I was not that great at the game, but I still had a lot of fun playing it. So that's what counts. Perdona mamá, pero ahí se fue el cambio. One thing that I have on my bucket list is to be able to test myself against other professional uh, fighting game players. Specifically because I know that if I were to play against some of them or playing against another individual in general, not only would I be able to improve a lot more, but I would also be able to learn a lot more. Specifically learn from somebody that already has a lot of experience. Go! that's gonna be it for this week's video i really hope you guys enjoyed it if you did please leave a like and also subscribe to my channel and turn on those post notifications so that you never miss out on a video or a live stream and with that being said this is the san diego shooting star signing out <laughs>